Victor Adanu and his two friends are supposed to be in their final year of studying physics at the University of Abuja, but they're not in class because of the indefinite strike by lecturers at government-run universities. The strike issue, it's affect, it affects me greatly because um, based on our school calendar, I was supposed to graduate this year, December. As we're supposed to graduate but because of the strike now we've been at home for like two months now and it aff affects the academic calendar greatly and so the university grounds are almost abandoned. Lecturers say the government has failed to implement a deal worth $9.3 billion that was agreed in 2009. If implemented, the plan would give them an increase in allowances, pensions, funding and research and development. The strike isn't just affecting students at the University of Abuja. Lecturers at 60 other government-owned universities are striking too, affecting tens of thousands of students. The union representing lecturers says striking is the only way to compel the government to implement the deal and save its institutions from collapse. If you go around our universities, you will see that there is total decay. The facilities are not there. The basic, you know, you, you understand that. For instance, you enter a chemistry laboratory and you discover that facilities, you know, consumables to conduct a simple experiment will be lacking. And so you understand that even the teachers are frustrated. They don't have the facilities to teach. The government says it's paid more than $624 million of the deal and just wants to be sure the rest of the funds are not mismanaged by academic staff. It's about the university becoming more responsible and determining what programs are focal and what to spend their money on. Back on campus, Victor and his friends support the striking lecturers, despite the impact it's having on their academic life. They say the government has the money to implement the full deal and should do so. But that means they're likely to have to wait another year or more before they can graduate. Ivan Dege, Al Jazeera, Abuja, Nigeria.